feel like you should move on and let this go, baby. You only need to be dwelling on this gal, bro. Babe, I telling you, babe, I gotta talk to Rhea about her and Vaughn, babe. Cause I need to know, is she juicing around with this nigga, babe? I hate, I hate, man. Do you, bro? But look here, don't say I didn't warn you. Nah, baby, Leon, babe. I need to hear this from her mouth. See what they saying? I ain't about to be around here to collect no fool. Hey, Rhea. Open the door, man. I need to talk to you about something. What you want, Ryan? Because I'm busy. Ah, uh, look here. I need to talk to you about Vaughn. Okay, and what about Vaughn? Vaughn, word around the street is you and Vaughn been getting busy. So you see, I will know if it's true. I will hear it from your mouth. Okay, look, Ryan. First of all, we're not together. So what I do or didn't do with any man for that matter is none of your flipping business. But you didn't know I feel about you, Doria. And no, I've been waiting for you to heal from that little situation thing, you see. Mom, but look like you didn't heal already and didn't even want to tell me. Okay, look, Ryan, you're cute and all, right? But let's face it, I need me a real man, okay? I mean, how are you, some schoolboy, going to help me survive in this world? Like, please explain that. How? Mom, come on, man, Rhea. I got money, man. I've been in these streets hustling like a dog, but I could take care of you. Just let me know. But it seems like you rather live with dingy dogs instead of a real man. Oh my God, Ryan, it's not like that. It's nah, Rhea. Everything cool. Everything cool, man. Just don't call me when you catch fleas. Ryan, wait! Mm-hmm, that's right, Nathan. School them young boys to the Lord. That's right. Yo, Vaughn. You think I'm playing with you when I say stay away from my daughter? Bruh, Mr. McPhee, what you talking about now? I have not been with your daughter. Boy, oh, don't play with me. I know that you and Gina's in a relationship. You, you see? You see what I was saying, right? Mom, I tell you forget that guy a long time, but she ain't bringing nothing but eat this way, Mom. Be wise to tell your brother my business. This is between me and you. Look, Mr. McPhee, I know what Gigi told you, but we are not together. As a matter of fact, your daughter can't stand my hip. Hey, Sister Chanel, you better come down here right now. Nathan just found out that Gina and Vaughn is in a relationship. What? That's impossible. Listen, I knew he said he was going to handle it, but I did not know he was going to come down here with a bot. You need to come now. Serves him right. Let Brother Nathan be consenting to him. Is there a problem here? Ah, uh, no, Pinder. Ain't no issue. Mr. Markfield is just leaving. Nah, don't seem like he is. To me, seems like he came here to do some damage. Look here, young man. I'm not talking to you. I'm here about my daughter, and this man keeps harassing her. A father fighting for his daughter. <laughs> I like it. I like it. Look here, Mr. McPhee. Gigi and I are not together. O-S-H. Is that Evan Pinder with your boys? Yes, it is. Sister Chanel, you better... Oh, no. This B.I.T. did not just hang up on me. How about everybody try to relax? And let's just talk to yourself the right... Look, I ain't going to ask you again to mind your own business. This here got nothing to do with you. <laughs> do you know who I am? 
Yeah, frankly, young boy, I don't give a damn. Everyone around here is scared of you, but I'm not. Hmm. You know, you got a lot of balls for an old man with no gun. Yeah, well, guns don't kill people. It's losers like you that kills people. Don, Vaughn, what you guys doing hanging around this no good trash? Woo! Even the old lady got mouth, huh? Yeah. Well, this old lady ain't scared of you. And you better stay away from my boys here. They be doing honest work. And they better stay as that. You hear me? Nah, see? That's the problem with you old folks now. Y'all don't got no respect for the future folks like us. So we gotta take it at any means necessary. Hey, wait, watch how you point that gun, boy. Don't be pointing that gun at my mommy like that dog. You crazy, eh? Relax, Pendo. Look, I'll clear this whole mess up. Boy, friend, that boy, you better put that gun away. Or else what? Huh? What? You gonna shoot me? Nah. You probably cry like a little punk that you are. The only kid is you holding that gun, thinking you're a man. Papinda, you need to relax. You're doing too much, bruh. That's my mom, peoples. Hey, hey, look here, woman, you better shut the hell up. You don't know nothing about my situation, and you don't know my story. Hey! Get that gun out of my mom's face. Well, well, well. If it isn't the queen herself, what's the matter, baby? What? You don't like the height? I mean, all of this? So for you? Yeah, that's what you can tell yourself. But all of this is about you putting fair into people through this corner. Yo, Gigi, what the hell is you doing, girl? Go back inside. Gigi. Yeah, I like the way that name sounds. So when I put you to work, I ain't even gotta make up a name for you. You don't scare me. You know what you are? You're just some punk kid who is probably bullied around who has a gun and have to make some kind of name for himself just so your little balls don't shrivel up. You better watch your mouth, girl. I ain't one to mess with. You better ask your little boyfriend over there about me. He's not my boyfriend, and like I said before, I ain't scared of you. I can shoot you right here? right now then do it what's the matter huh what are you scared oh wait is it too many people around are you just such a chicken that you can't even pull the trigger yourself nah i have something better in mind miss Molly. you got guts and i can see your folks they give you some heart so how about you for their life. Frick you. Ooh, I love when you talk dirty. Binder, what the hell? Hey, shut up, boy. Going once, going twice. Fine. Fine. No, Gina. No, Dad. It's okay. Fine, you can have me if you let all of them go. That's the deal. After I graduate, you can have me, but only if you leave here 
and you never come back. <laughs> Looks like we got a deal. Gina, why would you do that? Do you know what you've done? Oh my god, you could have been killed. But this just as bad, Gina. You can't give your body to that sick bastard just for us. Oh my god, either way, he was not leaving here until he gets something. You both should be thanking me, but instead, you're fussing me for saving your lives? Wait, what caused, Gina? I will not lose my princess. No, uh-uh. I won't lose my daughter to that street thug. So what are you saying? Your father and I have decided to send you to your grandmother. What? No way. I'd rather die. End the discussion. Go to your room. Wait, Vaughn, you can't be serious, babe. Why are you trying to go to talk to heaven, dog? You know he ain't had nothing what you said. He ain't gonna have nothing what you can say. Bro, I have to, man. This Gina, this ain't just some random girl. I. so you willing to rest your life over some girl who don't even want you, boy? She done give herself to the man, man. Let her go, boy. Ah, the hell with that. He can't and will never have her. Not as long as I live in. Bring it on, where you going, boy? Okay, Nikki, okay? I mean, even though you're annoying as hell, which you are, I will never let anything happen to you, Mom and Dad. Okay? You promise? I promise. I promise. 